so good evening everyone this class is based on problems with respect to quantities like uh, it's a uh, two quantities like milk water so vessels also there uh, those kind of problems we will start so how to proceed this kind of problem <coughs> i will teach you one or two methods or else one two three methods okay uh, when the problem standard also increases i will teach you the methods okay so here in a 80 liter of solution containing milk and water in the ratio 2 is to 3 how much milk should be added to the solution so that the new ratio becomes 4 is to 1 so here this is very important okay um, who are attending a, your uh, group exam this kind of ratio and the proportion questions are very very important so learn this kind of questions so here <coughs> how to proceed this okay so that is important so here first of all understand one thing 80 liter of solutions which contains milk and water in the ratio okay 2 is to 3 ratio how much milk should be added to the solution so here what you need to do is here the milk is added which means that the water remains same that ratio here is one ratio okay so that is the question so here let us take you out of 80 liter okay so this is the 80 liter mixture out of 80 liter mixture so actually initially this is the initial actual one so you have to write like this initial ratio is 2 is to 3 okay so here you write total so this is method one okay you write a total so total is 5 so your 2 by 5 3 by 5 part of 80 this is going to be the milk this is going to be the water so then here 80 so calculate this part then easily you can calculate the next part so then this is going to be the 16 then 48 here then 80 minus 48 obviously it is going to be the 32 so therefore initially 13 liter of milk there and 48 liter of water there so here the new ratio okay initial one the new ratio is 4 is to 1 here we are not adding anything with respect to a water therefore the water remains same here so the same is nothing but here 1 so therefore that 1x is going to be the what is water here 48 then x is going to be the 48 but we need to calculate how much milk should be added so milk in the ratio 4x so therefore milk so which is equal to 4x so now 4x is equal to 4 into 48 so after the milk should be added the solution new ratio will become so this is equal to 192 already how much of the water present in this so that you have to subtract so therefore 32 liter of the water already there then 160 liter we need to add so therefore 160 liter of milk should be added to make it 192 liters everyone understood yes sir so this is one method okay i will teach you the another methods in the upcoming problems uh, if you are having a doubt with the, this method please ask me or else i will tell you another method also you need another method with this problem itself so what is the initial ratio 2 is to 3 then what is the final ratio 4 is to 1 you are adding water then which is constant here 
this is milk this is water then which is constant here water is constant then to make water as a constant what you have to do is you have to multiply 3 here understood huh? the quantity should be same clear sir so therefore multiply your 3 then what will it will become 12 12 understood huh? then find the difference between these two what is the difference between these two 10 na? understood yes sir so this is 10 liter okay that is the difference okay listen carefully this is the difference this is the shortcut method first of all what is the initial solution total 5 okay 5 unit okay 5 unit which is equal to 18 liter so now 1 unit is equal to what 16 huh? but we need 10 units listen therefore 10 unit is equal to what 160 liter so therefore 160 understood the shortcut method this is shortcut clear huh? yes sir yes sir yes sir loan shortcut the shortcut method will help you to solve a problem in a cube manner if anybody having a doubt please clarify it itself no doubt means i will give you one question you people answer by using any method shortcut also you can use you can use the procedural method. <coughs> Shall I give you one problem? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Fine. Same method. Method three is uh, there, but uh, learn one or two method. That is enough. Yes, Sir, one down, sir. Hmm, tell Previous sum down. Hmm. Into three potting, sir. One into mm. three. Mm. Multiple mm. panning, sir. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Are they ready, sir? So, here you are adding milk only, right? Now, milk dump add pan wrong. Water add pan la. Punjicha. Upon the water add pan la, milk or quantity same other than going here. Okay, sir. Yes, 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 sir. Or getting the answer, you can give. Sir, is it 10? No. No. 10 is wrong. Ten is wrong. Anybody else? How much of water you need to add? 120. And pa, Rajshakar, 120. 28, sir. 28. Why 28? Listen. So I will tell you. What is the mixture? So this is the method one. So what is the mixture? 60 liter. So then milk. Then water. So year 7, year 5, so total 
60 then 7 by 12 into 60 then 5 by 12 into 60 so this is going to be the so here 5 star therefore 25 liter so obviously this is going to be the 35 liter so this is the initial okay to make <laughs> here what you are adding water only adding okay so therefore milk remains same right so what is the milk here so new ratio this is the final ratio 5 is to 7 so this is milk this is water so milk remains same so therefore this 5x is equal to 35 x is equal to 7 then what is 7x here 7x is equal to 7 into 7 49 liters so actually we need a 49 liters here so how much initial there initial 25 liters there therefore subtract this so 24 liter you need to add add 24 liters clear clear ah yes sir yes sir hmm. <coughs> wait uh, you people try with uh, that uh, shortcut method yes, anybody sir. anybody done uh, got 24 as answer uh? no sir why no sir fine okay i will teach you okay shall we move on to the next problem but uh, you got uh, answer uh, this one 24 any one of you got answer as 24 no uh. sir why is 5x is equal to 35 since water remains sorry milk remains same now nah? what is the here 5x this 5x is equal to 35 understood uh? previous problem listen previous problem this one na uh, one x is equal to 48 why one x is equal to 48 here since water remains same understood uh? this is milk this is water clear Didi? Yes, Deepthi understood? Huh? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Fine. Rasha, you understood? Huh? Ajay. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Sir, and the sum of the shortcut method is on the port again, but correct time and third, sir. And I can run 24 words, sir. 24 words, huh? Oh, no, sir. Short correct, yeah. Correct time method on the third button, okay? Okay. If I can. Milk water first race is 7 is to 5. Wait, initial. Yes, sir. So initially 7 is to 5. Yeah. Oh, sir. Final on the 5 is to 7. Is to so here this is milk. This is yes, water. Sir. Water only you are adding. Ah. Now yes, sir. What remains? Sir? Milk remains sir, same. Ah. So therefore you have to multiply 5 years. You have to multiply 7 years. Understood? Ah, that is good. That is good. That is correct. If you have 35 is to 25, yes, the new ratio will become 35 is to 25. Yes, 35 is to 49. Yes, 35 is to 49. What is the difference between these two? 14? Ah? No, 24. Ah? Yes, sir. Then 24 liters. Now listen, this is 35. So now, after this, out of finding out the difference, what is the procedure? Sir, the, actually, how much water should be added, then, sir? 24 ah, How much water should be added? Add so, add therefore, add. then 24 liters should be added. Yes. Yeah, yes, sir. Anybody having a doubt? No, doubt, sir. Ah. Or else you can go with uh, this one also. Okay. This proper method also you can go. Shall I move on to the next question? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. So, 80 liters of a mixture. I will teach you two to three methods here. Okay. Don't worry. Listen, I will uh, teach you one or two methods. And then if you need, I will teach you the third method also. If you want, I will teach you fourth method also. But be clear with the concept. 
So 80 liters of a mixture contains some milk and water in the ratio. How much is more water to be added? How much more water to be added to get the mixture containing the milk and water in the ratio 3 is to 1? Okay. So this is the question. So first of all, write the given data. Okay. To do the shortcut method. So this is a method one. Listen. This is method one. First of all, just write the ratios alone. Simple. So this is milk. This is water. I means initial. Listen carefully. I means initial. So initially 27. Here 5. Final 3 is to 1. So now listen carefully. Which is added? Water is added. Water is added. So therefore milk remains same. So that's make this quantity as equal. So therefore we have to multiply with 9. So therefore it will become 27 and 9. Understood this one? Clear? Yes sir. This is very important. Since water is added which means the milk remains same. Milk remains same means that you have to make the quantity as same. Therefore here 27. Here 3. 3 into dash is equal to 27. 9. Therefore you have to multiply. So now what you need to do is second step. The second step is find the difference between these two. What is the difference between these two? 4 yes, four liters. Now listen carefully. So now what is the initial units? Initial unit. 27 plus 5 unit. Which is equal to what initially? 80 liters okay so therefore 32 unit which is equal to 80 liters therefore one unit is equal to 80 by 32 liter but we need four liters right which means the four unit so now find out the four unit the four four unit which is equal to 80 by 32 into four then cancel this you will get the answer. So here 8 times. Then here cancel. So which is equal to 10 liters. You need to add. Understood? Yes sir. Shall I teach you another method? You want method? Another method? Yes, Having sir. doubt means please clarify. This method shortcut is very important. This is shortcut, learn shortcut method. <coughs> Quickly you can solve this kind of questions. I will teach you the another method. Listen carefully. So far, this is milk. So this is method 2. First of all, write me right here. This is method 2. So here milk, water, 27 is to 5. So totally 32 units. So this is total. 32 units. Which means that... 27 by 32 into 80 liter which is going to the milk 5 by 32 into 80 which is going to be the water clear so then obviously you will get a here cancel this here 8 table 8 fours are 16 table you can write 16 twos are 16 fives are so then 25 by 2. 25 by 2 is nothing but 12.5 liter. So then total here what is the mixture? Actual mixture is 80 liter. Subtract this. 80 minus 12.5. Then it will become 67.5 liter. Right. So therefore initially 67.5 liter there. Here 12.5 liter there. Okay. Then now listen. What you are adding? Water only adding. So therefore you are not adding anything with respect to the milk. So therefore 67.5 divisible by 12.5. You are adding some water. That water you can take it as x liters. So which is after adding the ratio will become 3 is to 1. Then cross multiply this 67.5. Then cross multiply this 12.5 into 3 is nothing but 37.5. Then plus 3x. Then subtract this. So subtracting you will get a 30 here. So which is equal to 3x then x is equal to 10 liter. Clear? This method? Yes, sir. Uh, you can go yes, with sir. this method also. <coughs> method 3, the, uh, this method. The first one we have done now. 
that method is the method 3 equating method you can go with the any method okay so clear shall i move on to the next problem anybody having a doubt with a see no, no, practice these kind of problems this is very important kind of problems milk and water that ratio whatever okay problem this quantity related problem is very important you need to practice at least a few questions who are facing the <coughs> state public service commission so as well as so now where is UPC asking application based only with respect to the ratio and problem they may ask with respect to problem on edges they may ask with respect to time speed work okay they may ask time distance so like that also so now this question shall i wait you people try yeah 20 liter of your mixture contains milk and water in the ratio how much more milk to be added so that is the water and milk and water will become in the ratio 4 is to 1 so you can use any method shall i wait one or two minutes yes sir yes sir Shortcut mother also you can use. Sir, uh, five. Five liter. Correct. Once uh -huh. you used which method? In the first method, first problem method. Okay, that also you can go with. So now, so first of all, if you are doing a shortcut method, write initial and a final. Then you take that mixture, milk and water. So here 3, 1, here 4, 1, here milk is added, right? How much more milk added? Water remains same. So which means that already it is in the same quantity. Therefore, you don't have to. So what, what is the second step? Find the difference between these two. So then the difference is equal to 1 unit. Okay. So what is the total here? 3 plus 1 unit which is equal to 20 liters so therefore 4 unit is equal to 20 liter 1 unit is equal to 5 liter we need the answer as 1 unit this is the answer the difference is the answer so therefore that 1 unit is what 5 liter so therefore you need to add 5 liter of the milk or else you can go with the method 2 also so I will teach you the method too. I am teaching two methods. <coughs> but uh, you need to practice with uh, one method. Yes, two method is also good. But don't go with the three, four methods. <coughs> so now method two, milk and water. So this is three, one. Total is four. Then three by four parts is going to be the milk. One by four part is going to be the water out of the total liters so therefore 5 liter here then all obviously 15 liter here okay so then after finding out this thing what you have to do so here you are adding the milk so therefore 15 right 15 plus x by water remains same so 5 by it will become 4 by 1 then cross multiply this then 15 plus x so which is equal to 20 then x will become 5 clear both the methods yes, sir sir hmm. method one what a confusion arka method one on the shortcut method listen shortcut method so you want me uh, ismail wait anybody wants me to explain in the english or shall i go with tamil for ismail so in english in english okay when you need method two also method one also again again i will tell you what is the step number one right okay i will tell you the step if you want to take it step one step one is write the given 
write the given ratios write the given ratios step 2 make the quantity as same same with respect to with respect to with respect to constant liquid so your constant liquid word means milk is added which means which is constant water is constant understood huh? so that is a step number 2 make the quantity as same with respect to the constant liquid so your water is the constant you are not uh, doing anything with respect to water you are adding only milk which is the case therefore we need to make this quantity as same but according to this question the quantity is same here but go through the previous question here so here water is added which means that we need to make the milk quantity as same but what is the quantity of milk here listen what is the quantity of milk here 27 and 3 so in order to make same quantity we have to multiply 9 with respect to final ratio so therefore the final ratio will become 27 is to 9 clear now the milk ratio is same milk quantity is same after milk quantity is same so everyone understood the step 2 yes sir fine let me give you the step 3 now so step 3 step 3 find the find the difference between the added quantity added quantity so which one we have added milk only we are adding see the question now milk only you are adding so that difference only you need to find out milk only you are adding therefore that different you need to find out so what is the difference one unit so that is the answer that is the answer one unit that is answer so now listen carefully difference is equal to one unit then one unit we need to find but what is the step number four i am writing here everything so please i will erase now please take the step or else you shall i keep uh, this pdf as like it is for a step sir so you people need uh, whatever i have written here yeah, yes sir keep fine. in the pdf fine fine then step number four listen carefully then step number four so sum up the sum up initial ratio equate to the given mixture quantity equate to the given mixture quantity so initial ratio is equal to here what 3 and 1 so therefore adding sum up so which means the 4 you need so which is equal to given mixture quantity the given mixture quantity here is 20 so then find the one unit that is the step number 5 find one unit one unit then step number 6 then step number 6 is the answer step number 6 nothing but the required number of unit so now listen carefully that required number of unit is nothing but the difference here clear huh? that arrow marker difference between yes. the added quantity so that is the step number six that is the answer so now read the steps then we go with one more problem who are having doubt smile clear huh? Clear, sir. So just read the steps. I will give you one more problem. So what is the step? Write the given ratios. Step number two: make the quantity as same with respect to the 
constantly queued okay which means that which is not going to be the added okay now step number three is find the difference between the added quantity that is the if milk is added means that difference you need to identify the step number four is nothing but you need to equate the ratios with respect to the initial ratios with respect to the given mixture quantity then the step number five is nothing but find out the one unit then step number six six difference going to be the answer so now i will give you the another question <coughs> It's a very easy practice. What is the answer? Anybody got the answer? Sir, just give one minute. Okay, okay, I will wait, I will wait. Fine, sir. Why taking too much of time? Pratish Dana. Sir, will it come in point, sir? Point, yeah. Why point? Uh? Why point? Initial milk water seven to uh, then uh, um, final seven three. So water is added. Water added means which remains constant. Which remains same. Milk remains same. So check with the milk quantities whether the quantities are same or not. If it is not same, you have to make it as a same. But here 7, 7, it is same. So if it is same, you go with the step number 3. Step number 3 is find the difference. Difference is equal to 1 unit. What is the step number 4? So add the initial ratios. 7 Sir, answer 81. Uh, Rashagar, why point decimal where you are making mistake? 81 sir. 81 sir. Ah, 81 is correct. So therefore 9 unit is equal to 7 to 9. 1 unit is equal to what? 81. 
ml so everything is in the ml only right see this one what is the answer answer also one unit only so therefore 81 clear ah huh? yes sir ah huh? tambi ismail sir i got the answer sir very good very good so method 2 anybody trying ah huh? method 2 Yes sir. yes sir i i did it then method 2 8 one correct appa yes sir hmm. yes sir Simple. but uh, it 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 will calculation romba perusa sir multiplication la undu ah okay fine ah we will move on with the next problem ah sir second method for me sir method 2 ah yes sir so method 2 ah so find out milk and water so totally total is nothing but water 9 so here 7 into 7 by 9 into 729 2 by 9 into 729 567 so 81 so 5 67 uh, this one 162 162 after finding out this uh, which one you are adding? Water only adding. Huh? So therefore, I am not doing anything with respect to the milk. I am adding with the water. That a liter is nothing but a ml is nothing but a x. Then it will become ratio 7 by 3. Then cross multiply. 5, one, 6, seven, 7, 3 into 7 into 162 plus 7x. So Rashi, 5, 6, 7 into Sir. 3. One one seven zero one. One seven zero one, which is equal to seven into one six two. Ah, uh, one 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 three four. One one three four plus seven x. So subtract this. Yes. One seven zero one minus one one five sixty seven. Five sixty seven, which is equal to seven x, which is already there. So therefore, here here, see. So therefore, x is equal to eighty one. Clear, ah? Rashi. Sir, Punicha, Sir, Yingama, the doubt was there. You get up pondering a calculation and spontaneous calculation. I remember the method. Method Lampurida, Anu Punicha, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, fine. So, shall we move to the next one? Yes, sir. Fine. So, now listen carefully. The quantity of nickel. So, read the question. The alloy. Contains copper, zinc, nickel in the ratio 5 is to 3 is to 2. The quantity of nickel that must be added to 100 kg of this alloy to have the new ratio 5 is to 3 is to 3 is. Okay. <coughs> First of all, simple only. So, by reading the question, don't get any kind of confusions. Okay. First of all, write the ratios. Initial. So copper, zinc, nickel, 5, 3, 2, final, 5, 3, 3. Now which is same? Copper same, zinc same. Suppose if it is not same, we have to make them as a same. But they are same. Since we need to add the nickel only, what is the difference between these two? One unit. Okay. So now add the initial ratios. Initial ratios, if you add, means 10 unit. 5 plus, so if you want, I will write 5 plus 3 plus 2. So which is equal to 100 kg? So therefore, 10 unit. 10 unit is equal to 100 kg. 1 unit is equal to 10 kg. But we need the answer as a 1 unit only. Answer which is equal to the 1 unit. So which is equal to 10 kg. Obviously, the answer is 10 kg. Clear, huh? Yes, sir. So, method 2 also we can do, but uh, time time taking one. So, this so answer is 10 kg of nickel should be added. Nickel added. Okay. So, now listen carefully. Suppose, if the difference is 2 unit, then what is the answer? 20. 20. Everyone understood, uh, but here the answer comes 1 unit, that is why 10 kg. Okay. 
Shall we move to the next question? Yes, sir. Okay. Fine. This kind of question. So whatever we have done here, okay, whatever we have done, this is the uh, method one kind of questions. So whatever we are going to see, this is the method two kind of questions. Okay, this is all method two kind of questions. Method two or else model two kind of question. I will write model. Okay, model two kind of questions here. If you read the question now, then you can able to understand. So the mixture contains milk and water in the ratio of five to two. And adding 22 liters of water, the ratio of milk. So here previous and all, how much of liters you are adding? That is the question. But here this question already given that this much of the liter of water is you are adding. Then the ratio will become. What is the initial water, or else they will ask you the initial milk present in the original mixture. So this is the kind of question you need to practice. Okay. So same method also you can apply here. So I will tell you one problem, then you can go with the some other problems. Listen, I will tell you here. Same method you apply. So what is the initial? So milk here. Then what is the final? So write like this. So here five. Here two. Then seven, five. So water added. Listen carefully. Water added. So which means which is remains constant. So therefore milk remains constant. You have to make this quantity as same. What you have to do? You have to multiply here with seven. You have to multiply with here five. Understood? Yes, sir. Then it will become thirty-five year. Year fourteen. Then it will become thirty-five year. It will become twenty-five. After making that quantity as same, then find out the difference between two. This two. What is the difference? So difference is equal to eleven unit. This difference only given here, twenty-two liters. Okay, that is the given. So now the given, which is equal to eleven unit. So that eleven unit is nothing but the twenty-two liter. Okay. Then now, uh, what is the one unit? So therefore, one unit is equal to what? One unit is equal to twenty-two two liter. Ah, two. Two liter. So what is the original? What is the original of water? Twenty-eight. Ah, yes, clear. Original mixture of water, which is equal to fourteen units. Clear. This is the original. Initial is nothing but the original. Okay. After making this quantity as same, that only you need to take. But you should not take with the two simply. You should take with the after making that. Quantity as same. That only you need to take. Fourteen unit. So the four fourteen into two. Twenty-eight liters. Understood? Ah. Having doubt? Ah. No sir. Having doubt means we will move with another method. We will move with another method. Ah. I will tell you the another method. Listen. I will give you both the methods, okay? But listen carefully. So method one we have done. I will teach you another method. This is method two to solve this problem. Actually, initial quantity. So that is the ratio, right? Given. Okay, five x and two x. So now which is adding? So you are not adding anything with respect to the milk. You are adding with respect to the water, twenty-two liters. Then the ratio will become seven by five. For many people, this method will uh, looks very simple. So 25x, which is nothing but the 14x plus 154, right? Then 11x, which is equal to what? 11x is equal to 154. Then x will become x will become 14. Okay. The quantity of the original mixture what? So this is milk. 
this is water so therefore original which is equal to 2x therefore 2 into 14 which is equal to 28 liters this mother also we can do clear yes sir uh, which method whichever you people feels easy you can suppose if you are having any doubts with respect to these two methods please clarify now itself i'll wait one, one or two minutes i'm waiting for you people If no doubt means you can say no, no doubt. No doubt, sir. No doubt. No doubt, sir. Clear. Sir, clear. Ajay, clear, Abba. Anu, clear. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Clear, sir. Grishma, clear, Abba. Grishma, Priyanka. Ram. Ram. Yes, sir. Clear, sir. Sir, yes, sir. Clear, sir. Okay, Ram. Satish, put in the chapa. Satish, Stella. Yes, sir. Fine. We'll move on to the next one. So, you people try this one. You people try this one. Same model, same model. But listen the question. Total quantity of the water in the new mixture, not the original mixture. New mixture means, okay, I will, I will wait. I will not give the solution. I hope... You people understood the difference between the previous question and this question. Same method, but the last step only you need to be very careful. Done. Sir, answer 40 years, sir. Ajay, then, pa? Yes, sir. Correct. Ajay, original mixture means? Sir, original mixture means uh, uh, 25, sir. Good, good, good. Correct. Correct. Ajay, correct. Both the, both the questions are correct. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Shall I do? Rashid, Munjicha. Yes, sir. Vamsi, Pratyush. Seven dose. Vendrosa. Yes, sir. You do it, sir. You can able to do, huh? Sir, trying to solve it. What, what's struggling with you? No, sir, I'm doing it. Just, I'm, Fine. I'm making the equation. Yeah. Fine. So suppose if anybody facing struggle, please clarify with me. Okay. Listen, I will teach you the method too. Okay. This method. Okay. Method two only we are going to do. So what is the initial? 7x of milk, then water, 5x. So I am not going to add anything with respect to the milk. Therefore, 7x. By, I am adding 15 liters with respect to the water. Therefore, 15 liters with respect to the water. So that water is nothing but here 15. So that ratio will become 7 by 8. Then cross multiply. So 5x plus 15. 
7 is to 5 yeah okay 5 pa. sorry pa. 5 x plus 15 so the 456 x then so which is equal to 35 x plus 105 then crash then bring this towards the LHS then it will become a 21 x which is equal to 105 then x will become 5 yeah. yes sir, yes, sir. then uh, listen carefully initial final ratio 7 is to 8 okay so that is the question the 7x part of milk 8x part is water but the question is dealing with the new mixture so this is nothing but the final is nothing but the new mixture okay if it is so we are adding you are the question is uh, with respect to the total quantity of water in the final mixture so therefore you have to be very careful with the question that option will be there 25 also will be there in the array situation you should not mark it as a 25 that is what you need to be very careful with the what the question demands so that for total quantity of the water in a new mixture so which is equal to 8x so 8 into 5 star 40 liter anybody having a doubt ismail punicha ंग <laughs> You are done, huh? I'm serious. Yes, I have done just I, that's why I, I got 5 and I thought 5 would, uh, will be the answer. Fine. Okay, we will do that method. Listen. So, initial. Final. Final. 7 is to 8. Huh? So, now what we are adding? Huh? We are adding water. Then uh, milk remains same. Huh? Yes, here same. So, what is the difference? Difference 3 unit. Difference is 3 unit. Then 7 plus 5 units, which is equal to water. Nothing. Understood. But what, what given is that 3 unit has been given. What is the 3 unit? 15. 3 unit, which is equal to 15. Therefore, 1 unit, which is equal to 5. But we need a 8 unit. So that is the new mixture. Ismail, understood uh, where you are struggling. So 8 into 1 unit is nothing but water. 5 liter. 8 into 5 is nothing but water. 40 liter. Clear, uh, Ismail? Yes, sir. I have to 15 liter. I have to use 2 liter. I have to use 2 liter. I have to use 2 liter. Vamsi, Purnu, Chha, Chha, Vamsi, understood. Fine. Next, next question. People, people, please do, do it, do it fast. The total quantity of the new mixture. Listen, the question is new mixture. Listen, what is the difference between the previous question and this question? The total quantity of the water. It is clearly mentioned total quantity of the water in the new mixture. But here the question is total quantity of the new mixture. So 15. Huh? 15. 15 now. No. 30 sir. Rajasagar, new mixture Rajasagar. Sir, 40 sir. Ajay, in the top one ringer. The milk and water in a mixture of 1 is 2, 3. If 5 liters of the milk are added to it, the ratio of the milk and water will become the new mixture 
becomes 1 is to 2 that all the quantity of new mixture in liters sir 45 ah correct yes. ajay 45 pa enga miss aachu sir na plus 5 add pannama verum original mixture mattum add panni solitta sir ah what is the question what is the question total quantity of the new mixture yes sir yes sir ha huh. in this case what you need to do old mixture plus sir? Initial mixer plus the new one. I yes. Sir. yes. That you need to add. That is the question demands. Listen, that words only you need to be very careful. Okay, please. That is what I am giving you with respect to different different questions. Shall we? Shall I do? Are people doing means I'll wait. Don't worry. I'll wait for one or two minutes. If few people required means. If anybody doing. just tell me shall i do i yes, do sir. fine but don't worry okay if you are not getting the answer practice only will make you to become a master okay so practice everybody is a learner only beginner only okay 0% to 100% okay don't be in the 0% level just work out then slowly gradually move in this part to reach 100% that is my suggestion rest is your choice so now listen carefully here initial one so this is milk then this is water three final one two then uh, Listen carefully. Milk only added, ah. So what is the remaining? So water. So milk is added means water should be constant. Water should be constant means we have to make this as a same. Then what we need to do is we have to multiply here with respect to two. We have to multiply here with respect to three. Then it will become two six. Then three six. Now quantity as same. What is the difference? Difference is equal to three minus two, which is equal to one unit. okay then uh, this is going to the one unit okay that one unit is nothing but uh, what you are adding 5 liter of milk so therefore one unit is that difference is going to be the added one so therefore 5 liters so now the question is dealing with the total quantity of the new mixture okay so new mixture means what uh, this part so which means that uh, after equating that part this is the new one this is the initial one so new one unit is equal to 5 liter so new one total mixture means this two together you are understood so the new mixture is equal to <coughs> sorry 6 plus 6 plus 3 unit which is equal to 9 unit 1 unit is equal to 5 liter 9 unit is equal to 9 into 5 which is equal to 45 liters clear suppose if the question is what is the total quantity of water in the original mixture total quantity 30, of the sir. water in the original mixture 30 30 sir rashi sir the one ah 5 sir wait, wait rashi sir Quite, quite. Rajesh okay. should be quite. Okay. Let others try. Let so, us try. initial uh, quality of water or milk, sir. Let me let me raise the question now. Please clear. What is the total quantity of orig uh, total quantity of water in the original mixture? Sir, thirty, sir. Thirty, correct. That correct. What is the original quantity of Sorry, not the original quantity. What is the total quantity of milk in the new mixture? I just stop. I just stop. Anybody else? Fifteen. Ah, huh? so Pratish giving fifteen. Correct. Now Pratish stop. Few people. Okay, those who have answered, please stop. I'll just try. Total quantity of. Okay, total quantity of original mixture. Forty, sir. Forty. Clear, ah, huh, everyone. 
I hope yes, you So this one question uh, itself, I didn't get, sir. Uh, huh? uh, someone told 30, right? That one I didn't understand. So what you are not getting what is the 30, yeah? Yeah. So yes. listen, the total quantity of the total quantity of water in the original mixture is 30. So you listen, original original is nothing but the initial. Water oh, is nothing yeah. but this part. Six. six Understood? Okay, okay, we sir. need six unit, uh, Bumsi. One yes, unit sir. is equal to five liters. Six unit is equal to 30 liters. Water. Yeah, okay. Clear? Uh? Yes, sir. Yes. So with one question itself, we can form any any kind of... Uh, okay. So now, shall we move to the next question? Yes, sir. So in a mixture of 25 liters, the ratio of acid to the water is 40, say sorry, uh, is 4 is to 1. Another 3 liter of water is added to the mixture. The ratio of the water, uh, sorry, the ratio of the acid to the water in the new mixture, this is the model 3. Model 3. So we have done model 2 also, this is model 3. Okay, model 1 we have done, model 2 done, model 3. In a mixture of 25 liters, the ratio of acid to the water is 4 is to 1. So, which means that the initial. Another 3 liter of water is added to the mixture. Okay. The ratio of acid to the water in the new mixture. So, that is the question. 5 is to 2, sir. 5 is to 2. Okay. You can go with any method. Okay. Which method you have done? Normal. Sorry, okay, normal. Okay, normal. So now for listen carefully. Initial quantity. Let us take. So initial quantity. Okay. Acid. 4x. Water. X. So this 4x plus x which is equal to water. 25 liters. So then x is equal to 5. x is equal to 5 means acid water. Acid 20, 20 liter. Then water 5 liter. Okay. So now listen carefully. So you are not adding anything with respect to acid. You are adding 3 liter with respect to 3 liter water. with respect to this one water then what is the ratio 20 by 8 ratio 20 by 8 also uh, you can simplify then it will become 5 by 2 this is nothing but 5 is to 2 clear huh? yes or no yes sir yes sir anybody struggling with this kind of questions no sir so initial always remember initial is nothing but the acid then so this much of acid this much of water then the total is going to be the 5 then out of 25 liters then what is going to be the acid and what is going to be the water that only we are doing listen so therefore here 4 by 5 part into 25 then 1 by 5 part into 25 that is going to be the acid and the water then this will become 5 then 20 then it will become so here 5 so after this how much added? 3 liter of added. So 3 liter means it will become 20 is to 8. That, that is the ratio. 20 is to 8 can be simplified. This is the equation method 4x plus x. So this is the shortcut method. This is the simple one. Okay, you can go with any method. So suppose if you are having any doubt, please clarify. Am I going too fast? No. Yes. No, sir. Fine. You need to practice a lot. Yes, sir. See, I am taking these kind of lot of questions I am taking. But uh, people using in the right direction means they will learn also. I know. But uh, I am taking lot of questions. Okay. So, we, variety of questions you need to practice. So, now, two equal vessels are filled in the filled with the mixture of... Listen, this is the model kind of four, four, uh, fourth model kind of questions. Two vessels. We are dealing with the, so far we are dealing with the one vessel. So here the another vessel. Okay. 
two equal vessels are filled with the mixture of the milk and so this is a moral kind of four let me write here since it's a foundation class uh, i'm giving all the models so two equal vessels are filled with the mixture of milk and water in the ratio 3 is to 2 and 4 is to 1 if uh, the mixture is poured into the third vessel the ratio of the milk and water in the third vessel will be anybody trying so 7 is to 3 7 is to 3 correct 7 is to 3 correct yes yeah, simply adding the two sir ha huh, simple yes simple adding listen what is the concept here is if two quantity of the both the vessels are equal so that is the question here two equal vessels are filled okay if the total quantity of uh, both the vessels check the total quantity 5 5 check 5 liter 5 liter uh. take the note take this yes, important sir. note so 3 is to 2 is equal to 5 add add this to 4 is to 1 add this to 5 listen so this is the note you need to take down if total quantity if total shall i dictate yes sir if total quantity of both vessels are equal then then ratio of then so this is third okay then ratio of third vessel is ratio of sum of milk is to the ratio of so not ratio of sum of sum of the ratio of let me write like this or else i will give you in another way then uh, the ratio of the third vessel is milk plus milk is to water plus water so what is the milk here 3 here 4 then 7 then water is 2 here 1 the four it will become 3 clear or else listen method 2 this is one method the answer you can directly give as 7 is to 3 shall i move on with method 1 this is shortcut method also done this is method 1 i'll teach you the method one also listen so first of all this is vessel one 3 is to 2 this is vessel two 4 is to 1 what is the total 5 5 okay then this is milk this is water ratio so what is the total quantity of milk so which is equal to 3 by 5 part here 4 by 5 part which is equal to 7 by 5 part then the total quantity of water 2 by 5 part 1 by 5 part so which is equal to 3 by 5 part their ratio only asking 7 by 5 is to 3 by 5 5 5 cancel it will become 7 is to 3 you can go with any one the concept one or else uh, the proper one you can go with any method shall i move to next question yes sir okay 
so variety of questions we are doing okay there are two containers of equal capacity the ratio of the milk to water in the first container 3 is to 1 in the second container 5 is to 2 if they are mixed up ratio of the milk to the water in the mixture no uh, is it possible to use the previous concept here no why no since here 4 here 7 so therefore we cannot use the previous concept clear i hope everyone is clear with respect to the previous concept and this concept yes sir okay so what is the question here two containers container one milk then total three one four container two five two seven okay then what you have to do three by four plus five by seven five to four like ah previous method you people doing that one ah very good yes sir very good method okay that is what i have done this method suppose yes this method is very good method so without any confusions you can go with this one total quantity of milk so first one 3 by 4 second one 5 by 7 so what is the lcm 28 then it will become 21 plus 20 21 plus 20 41 huh? clear huh? then total quantity of water which is equal to water 1 by 4 1 plus by 2 4. by 7 yes plus 2 by 7 so here also 28 uh, then 7 plus 14 21 uh, 7 plus 7 plus 8 no, 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 no. here wrong so 28 uh, so here 15, we have to multiply 15. with respect to 7 the was 7 here we have to multiply with the 4 15, sir. okay 15 uh. 15 by 20 yes sir yes sir that ratio only right the ratio is equal to 4 by which is equal to 15 by 28 28 28 okay then 41 is to 15 so clear uh? 41 is to 15 anybody having a doubt no doubt uh? this method is enough right yes sir i think one method is enough or else what you have to do is uh, you need to go with the total quantity as same listen carefully that method also same so here i will teach you the method listen what is the total quantity here Five, five, yeah. What is the what is the thing here? Listen, listen. You can go with the, that shortcut method also, but you need to be very careful here. Four. Here, four seven. Ah, make the total quantity as same. What do you have to eight, do? Twenty eight. Seven. Twenty seven. Four. Ah, multiply the throughout equation. Clear? Ah. Yes, then it will be here. It will become twenty one here. Clear? Ah, that method. Ah, that method also you can go. Then you can add. You will get the same answer fine do one thing hello ah come see so, oh nothing sir. i thought you are on mute no, 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 I am here only, um, see, I am, uh, just wait. Still few more problems are there. So you people want to try or you people want to learn? If people want to learn means I will teach you in the next class. If people want to try means I will give you the slides, everything today itself. Choice is you people.
try and learn sir huh <laughs> okay so do one thing sir ah uh, uh. uh, want to learn so kindly uh, will you share today the slides no no that is what i am saying i will share here i i'm giving 10 10 15 questions another 12 questions are here okay, okay. another 14 questions are here you people want to try out first in question by own or else you people want to learn in the next class that is my question so want to learn okay then i will teach you then i will wind up this class here okay i will stop here uh, whatever we have done today that as pdf i will give you right now okay okay sir thank you all have a good day thank you sir